Have you ever thought about how, like, knowing where things are happening could actually unlock, like, hidden potential in your business? It's more than just knowing where, right? Yeah. It's about understanding location, space, all of that. Yeah, yeah. exactly. We're talking about location data, and uh, today we're going to do a deep dive into the insights from that IDC Research Global Location and Geospatial Intelligence Insights webinar they did back in December 2024. So it's a bit of a mouthful. It is a mouthful, but we're going to break it down, pull out the important stuff, you know, make it clear how this location intelligence is changing businesses globally. I think a lot of folks listening probably have a sense of how location data is important, you yeah. know, delivery companies, ride sharing, all that. Oh, for sure. But this webinar, it goes deeper. You know, yeah. it's about how investing in this stuff like location and geospatial intelligence can actually improve like those key performance indicators, the KPIs that every business is tracking. We're talking about real results here, not just theory. Exactly. And we'll look at where integrating this location smarts, if you will, can have the biggest impact. And we'll see how businesses are using this to create like those really great customer experiences that people are coming to expect. It's about staying competitive. Yeah, 100%. So if you're thinking about using your resources better or connecting with your customers more effectively, or even just getting a clearer picture of how your business operates, this deep dive should give you some things to think about. We'll also touch on how businesses can start using this no matter how big or small they are. It seems like this webinar you mentioned really highlighted all the benefits businesses are seeing from using geospatial and location intelligence. It's becoming a core part of doing business, not just something extra on the side. Absolutely. But they didn't just say things are getting better. They had some really specific numbers, right? What kind of KPI improvements really stood out to you? Well, one thing that really jumped out at me was the concrete impact across different areas. And this was really noticeable in retail and e-commerce, where knowing customer foot traffic and online behavior, like in relation to location, was super helpful for targeting their marketing. It's also about understanding how they move around and what they do online, all within a spatial context, right? You got it. Think about getting a promotion for something happening locally or at a store that's near you, mm -hmm. right? That kind of personalization, it makes customers more loyal. That makes a lot of sense. It's so much more relevant than just sending out a generic message to everyone. What about the operational side of things, though? Did they talk about efficiency gains, too? Oh, definitely. They gave the example of transportation and logistics, where they saw big improvement thanks to better routing and real-time tracking using geospatial data. Think about the fuel savings and how much more efficient that makes things. Yeah, that adds up quickly. For sure. They also mentioned field service industries, where companies were using location intelligence to schedule and allocate resources better. This isn't just some theory. It's making a real difference. The webinar also talked about integrating this location intelligence into existing systems. It's not meant to be a standalone tool, is it? You hit the nail on the head. We've seen how it impacts KPIs, but now let's see how businesses are getting these results. They really emphasized how important it is to smoothly integrate this with things like customer relationship management systems, your CRMs. By adding location data to customer profiles, businesses get a much deeper understanding of their customer base, which helps them target their sales and marketing much better. So you're not just looking at past purchases, you're also seeing their geographic behavior, and that can inform all sorts of decisions. Exactly. From where to open new stores to fine-tuning those local marketing campaigns. It all ties together. Another important integration point they highlighted was with supply chain management, or SCM, systems. By using location data to track goods and assets in real time, businesses can choose optimal warehouse locations based on transportation networks and even predict potential problems based on what's happening geographically. This makes the whole supply chain more resilient and efficient. Makes sense, especially with the global economy being so interconnected. Any disruptions can have huge consequences, so having that spatial awareness in your supply chain seems essential. Totally agree. They also talked about connecting this to marketing platforms. I imagine there's a lot of potential there. Oh, absolutely. This integration allows for what they call hyper-personalized campaigns. Think about a retailer targeting customers within a certain radius of a store with limited time offers or an online business customizing its ads based on where people are searching from. The webinar showed that this type of location-based marketing gets way higher engagement rates. It's taking marketing to a whole new level, going beyond basic demographics to real-time location and context. We can't forget about the customer experience, though. They highlighted how location intelligence is making those interactions smoother and more satisfying. 
Can you give us some examples of that in action? Sure. One really cool example is in personalized recommendations and offers delivered in real time. Let's say you're using a retailer's app and you happen to be near one of their stores. You might get a notification about a sale on something you were looking at before. This kind of immediacy and relevance really improves the customer experience. It's almost like having a personal assistant who knows what you like and what's available nearby. <laughs> Precisely. It's a world away from those mass emails that nobody wants. For sure. Another important area is in optimizing service delivery. We see this all the time with ride-sharing apps using your location to find you a driver, or food delivery services giving accurate arrival times based on traffic and where the driver is in real time. Location intelligence is key to making these services work seamlessly and efficiently, which is what customers expect now. It goes beyond those obvious examples too, doesn't it? Even something like a utility company using location data to pinpoint exactly where a power outage is can help them respond faster and keep customers informed better. Exactly. It can also lead to more proactive customer service. A business might use weather data combined with customer locations to predict potential service disruptions and then reach out to customers with useful information or solutions. So it's all about anticipating needs and meeting the customer where they are, both literally and figuratively. Now, for someone listening who's thinking, OK, this sounds great, but this is probably only for big tech companies. What did the webinar say about how businesses can get started with this without spending a ton of money up front? That's a great question. The webinar addressed that directly. The first thing they emphasized was to really focus on the benefits. Figure out what problems in your business could potentially be solved with location intelligence. Don't get bogged down in the technical details right away. Start with the why. So figure out what you're trying to solve before you go out and buy a bunch of tools. Exactly. The second takeaway was to identify specific ways to use it, you know, use cases, that align with your business needs and will give you a clear return on investment. They suggested starting small, maybe with a pilot project in a specific area, to see how location data can make a difference. Start small, test it out, get a feel for it. Right. Don't try to do too much at once. Yeah. The third crucial takeaway was the importance of investing in analysis. Just having location data isn't enough. You need the tools and expertise to make sense of it and turn it into useful insights. This could mean training your current staff, hiring experts, or working with outside providers. It's like they say, data is useless without analysis. Exactly. The webinar made it clear that even basic location intelligence can provide real value, and there are more and more platforms and tools out there that are accessible to businesses of all sizes. That's good to know. It seems like it's becoming more and more accessible to everyone. It really is. Okay, so just to sum up our deep dive into this IDC webinar, it's clear that location and geospatial intelligence are powerful tools that can lead to real improvements in important business metrics. The key seems to be integrating this intelligence into existing systems to optimize everything from how you interact with customers to how efficient your supply chain is. And if you're just getting started, remember to focus on the why, find specific ways to use it, and invest in the ability to analyze the data. And for those of you who are thinking, this is interesting, where can I learn more? The webinar specifically mentioned the Google Maps platform website is a great place to start. They offer a wide range of mapping and location services that businesses can use. Sounds like a good first step just to see what's out there. Absolutely. And they also have a solution finder tool on their platform that can help you find relevant applications for location intelligence based on your industry and the specific challenges you're facing. So you don't have to sift through everything on your own. Nope. They've got you covered. They also mentioned an impact calculator, which can help businesses estimate the potential return on investment for different location-based solutions before they commit a lot of resources. That sounds really helpful. It is. The main message from the webinar was pretty clear. Understanding the where is becoming essential if you want to unlock your business's potential and stay ahead of the competition. No matter what industry you're in, location matters. It really does. So here's something to think about. Consider all the location-related data that surrounds your business or your own areas of interest. What hidden patterns or opportunities could you discover if you had a better understanding of the where? And how could that knowledge change what you do in a big way? That's something worth exploring. Food for thought. Thanks for joining us for this deep dive. My pleasure. Thanks for having me.